Hello and welcome to the history of movie theaters and drive-ins for Evansville, Indiana for 1940 to 1979. Nineteen forty one. The Franklin Theater reopens after being rebuilt. Nineteen forty seven. The drive in theater opens on July fifteenth on the site of the showplace East Cinema. 1948 The family drive-in opens on July 3rd. 1949 The Ross Theater opens on December 25th. The Mary Lane Theater closes. 1950 The Sunset Drive-In opens on October 4th. 1953 The West Side Drive-In opens on July 17. 1954 The Royal Theatre closes. 1955 The Palace Theater opens on May 16 and closes later in the year. The American Theater is renamed Gay Mark on November 4, 1955. 1956 The Gay Mark Theater closes on November 25 the date of its last newspaper listings. Premier Theatres closes the Alhambra Theatre. 1957 Premier Theatres closes the Rosedale and Woodlawn Theatres. 1959 The Carlton Theatre is closed by Premier Theatres. 1962 The Grand Theatre is closed by Premier Theatres. 1968 The Courier and Press on November 9 reports that General Cinema is to build Cinema 1 and 2 with the owner of Cinema Theatres objected to the name. It never opened. The Theatre A opens on November 15 at the site of the old Rosedale Theatre. 1970 The Franklin Theatre reopens on January 23rd as the studio art showing adult movies. On March 6th, the Columbia Theatre is renamed Cine West. Lowe's sells the Victory Theatre to their former employee, Paul Steeler, who sets up Victory Theatres, which later became Showplay Cinemas. 1971 
These theaters were renamed on February 23 until 1973. The Carol's Twin Cinema opens on June 25. Lowe's sells the Majestic Theater to Victory Theaters. 1973. The Washington Square 1 and 2 is opened by Carol's on January 12. The North Park Cinema 1 and 2 is opened on December 25th by Victory Theatres. The Carol's Twin Cinema is taken over by Cinema National. The Cinema 41 Drive-In closes. The Majestic Theater is closed by Victory Theaters. 1974 The East Park Cinemas is opened on November 6 with three screens by Victory Theaters. The Cine West stops showing movies and is renamed Evansville Civic Theater and became a live theater. The theater A become an adult cinema. 1976 The Washington Theater reopens with two screens. The Evansville Drive-In is reopened with three screens. Victory Theaters sells the North Park 1 and 2 to Joe Kohler. 1977 The West Side Drive-In reopens with two screens on April 8. The Ross Theater reopens with two screens on November 25th seating 750 and 200 seats. The Victory Theater reopens with three screens on December 23rd. The Theater A stops showing adult movies and is split up into two screens. 1978 The North Park Cinemas expands to six screens on August 25th. The Carol's Twin Cinema is taken over by Atco Canton Theatres until 1979. 1979 The Victory Theater stops showing movies or conversion into a live theater. Thanks for watching. Remember to like and subscribe.